Hey folks, this is Troy here at SwagOffRoad.com. I'm going to show you guys a new product I came out with. It's a press brake designed to fit the Harbor Freight 20 ton press. I'll be selling this on my website in kit form. It will be a do-it-yourself kit. You will be required to do the final welding and assembly on your own. I'll give you an idea of what the kit consists of. The kit has three sheet metal parts made out of quarter inch thick steel cut on a laser and formed on a press brake. Uh, the top one there is going to be your base plate. The metal one will be your backstop. And the third one will be your side stop. Give you an idea of what I'm talking about. Your side stop has 17 laser cut notches. Each notch represents the distance from the notch to the center line of the die. So the first one is going to be two inches away, the second one is going to be three inches away, and so on. If you have your backstop, which slides on these rails, you line up the notches like so. Tighten your uh, two Allen head set screws. This allows you to do repeatable bending over and over again. The top die consists of four inch, three quarter inch thick flat bar. That's been machined to a 60 degree, 60 degree angle on the bottom surface. You have your 3 quarter inch rod, your inch and a quarter DOM tubing, uh, two springs, your fasteners, your 3 quarter inch guide rod, as well as this little cup here to uh, make sure your die is centered in the press. Give you an idea of some of the parts that I bent up. Here's a mixture of 8 inch, 16 gauge, quarter inch and three eighths. We got some eighth inch, some three eighths by three, more three eighths, some quarter. That's 12 inch long piece of quarter inch thick. That gives about the maximum length you can bend. Uh, that's more three eighths, some eighth inch back there, and here's a cutaway of the top die. Again, it's been machined, 60 degree angle on the top surface. Give you guys a demonstration here. I'll be bending up this piece, which is two inch, quarter inch thick flat bar. First and foremost, I'm going to make sure your press brake is completely supported on the bottom surface. You're going to need more than just the two press plates that you get when you buy the press. Center up your workpiece. You are able to bend up to a 19 inch wide piece from edge to edge. There you have it. On thinner gauge steel, you can bend up to 110 degrees. On thicker gauge stuff, uh, 3 inch and quarter, you're limited to about 93 degrees. I'm selling these in kit form on my website, which is swagoffroad.com. Comes with detailed instructions and everything you need to uh, to build a kit. If you got any questions, let me know. Thanks. Bye.